Hi there, today we're unboxing a Wi-Fi light bulb. So this particular light bulb is by a company called Energe and it's the fitting E27, so a screw-on connector. Works with both the Amazon Alexa and the Google Home. So let's have a quick look around the packaging. Comes very nicely packaged here. There you go. Let's open it up, see what you get in the package. So the actual bulb. And some instructions. Okay. Looking at the actual bulb itself. Construction seems good. I don't like this particular colour here they've got. But that's not a major thing. Construction wise seems okay, well constructed, nothing's loose, so that's good. Let's have a quick look at the instructions, just to confirm, yep, all in English, on both sides. Okay, so I've had a look at the actual manual that comes with this, and it recommends using an app called NRJ Smart App. So this app is available on Android devices and Apple devices. Now what I've found, I've reviewed a couple of items by this company and the Smart Life app is exactly the same as this one. But the advantage of using the Smart Life app is that it integrates with Google Home and the Amazon Alexa. So for this demo, I'm actually just gonna use the Smart Life app. So first of all, let's get the bulb and I've got a, a lamp here just attach it onto the lamp. Okay, next thing we want to do is get our Android device and I'm going to start up Smart Life. So just starting there. Now on there you'll see a plus icon if I click on that and what we're adding is a lighting device. So if we turn this lamp on what we're expecting it to do is rapidly flash. Now that's quite slow. I don't think that's correct. So if I turn it on and off a few times, There you go. Okay, so if your light isn't rapidly blinking, what you do, as I've shown, a number of times, maybe five to eight times, just turn it on and off, on and off, until it's blinking as quick as this. So now, let's go back to our app. You'll see on there, confirm light rapidly blink. So, once I confirm that, what will happen, I'll get another dialogue asking for my Wi-Fi password. So let me do this off camera. Okay, just confirm that and now it's going to attempt to connect. Okay, so the light stopped blinking now. And I guess it's going through its initialization phase. There you go. Okay, so the light bulb's configured now, and what you'll see is this RGB bulb R60. So quite interesting. I've done a few Wi-Fi light bulbs, but this is slightly different. So it's got something called common functions. So initially you've got a button there, on off. So that's quite good, quick access to it. You've got a mode as well. We can quickly go to different sort of set modes you have there. Let's go there and another one to set the brightness. Which is quite good, a quick way of accessing the functionality. So now if I click on there, we'll go into some other options this has. So more comprehensive, granular sort of options. So dark to light, sorry, dark to bright. So you can lower the brightness of it. 
make it brighter, bright to plain, so different levels. Oh, came straight out of it. Okay, let me click on color, so different color levels. Very easy to use. Okay, go back. Okay, scenes, different defined scenes there. Back. And timer. So this is quite a useful feature. So this will give you the ability to set different timers and allows you to turn the bulb on at set times. So you could say, you could have it as a, just a one-off thing. So you just want to turn on once when you know you're going to be out. Or you could set a regular schedule. So just pick the days you want, like so. And then you can say the time you want it to turn on and just click on and save. And the same applies for turning it off. Set the time you want it to turn off, set it as off, and then save that. Very useful, useful facility you got there. So there you have it, very simple to set up and configure. So let's have a go at seeing it working with the Google Home and Amazon Alexa. Okay, so I've got my Amazon Alexa set up here and I've got my Google Home here. So let's attempt to do the actual Google Home first. So you go into the Home app and let me show on here. You go into home control and then click add. And you can see my nest, which is already there. And I'll look for smart home, which is, oh, smart life, I mean, sorry. And then you just need to type in your details here that you've used previously to set up the device. So let me do that off camera quickly. And then we just need to allow Google to access it. So there's an authorize button, which I've also clicked. So I've just done that. There you see all the existing bits of tech I've got, smart tech, and there's the bulb. So we could say that's gonna be in the living room, for example. So if I just click done, so now if I say, okay, Google, turn on living room light. Okay, turning RGB bulb R60 on. Okay, it's already on, that's why it's done that. So, okay, Google, turn off living room light. There you go, turning RGB bulb R60 off. Okay. And let's turn it on. So, okay, Google, turn on living room light. Sure, turning RGB bulb R60 on. There you go, as simple as that. Very easy to link in. So next one, let me show the actual Amazon Alexa. Okay, so on your Amazon Alexa app, if you go in there and enable the skill, so the one you wanna look for, I can show this. Uh, smart life click it there it's just there we enable it and then if I enter in my account details I'll do that off camera okay I've entered my account details and authorized Alexa to allow it to access devices and then it says discover devices let it discover now. Starting discovery. This will take up to 20 seconds. If you haven't already, please enable the smart home skill for your smart device from the Alexa app. So once it's scanned, we want to look for RGB. I couldn't find any new smart home devices. Okay, that's if probably... you have Philips Hue, press the button on the bridge and rerun discovery. Okay, that's because I've already run it in the background. Uh, previously, so the bulb's just there, RGB bulb. If I go into it, see it turning on, turning off. So let's test it out, just confirm it works. Alexa, turn on RGB bulb R60 on. Okay, so it's turned on RGB bulb R60 on. Okay, so it's turned on RGB bulb R60 on. Okay, so it's turned on RGB bulb R60 on. Ok
turn on RGB bulb. Okay. Alexa, turn off RGB bulb. Okay. So there you go. Very simple to set up, very easy to use as well. Okay, so you've seen it unboxed, you've seen it set up on your mobile device, you've seen it configured with an Amazon Alexa, you've seen it configured with a Google Home. Very easy to set up, very simple to use, works very well, and there you go. Hope it's helped anyone thinking of purchasing this particular Wi-Fi bulb. Thanks for viewing, and don't forget to like and subscribe.